Rain showers invaded Ohio Thursday morning, and it's going to continue throughout the day into Friday morning as a cold front slides to the south of the state. 7 a.m. surface map looks like this. We'll get this entire area of the Ohio Valley all the way down through the lower Ohio Valley into the Mississippi Valley with a full-fledged flood of rain just coming all the way out of the Gulf of Mexico into this region. And it'll slide to our south, and then a warm front will develop and move that to the north. If you take a look at the future view map, you can see that in action. High pressure will build over the area on Friday. Once the high moves to the east, that cooled front to the south of us will be developed back into a warm front, move northward. And believe it or not, that'll open the door for another five days of temperatures well above normal. Daytime highs average in the upper 40s now, and our temperatures are going to be 15 to 20 degrees above that once Sunday rolls around. So they're not looking at too terribly cold temperatures at all. Travelers forecast for the state of Ohio on the day Friday. You can see it's going to be a beautiful day with high pressure overhead. Here are your daytime highs from border to border. Enjoy the sunshine while it lasts because once the warmer air moves back in, so do the chances of precipitation. With that in mind, let's take a look at your five-day forecast. So the first day of your five-day forecast doesn't look too bad, does it? A little cooler than what you've been used to the past few days, but <laughs> you've been spoiled with a spring preview. Other than that, temperatures warm up once again toward the beginning of next week, but a chance of precipitation every day. Have yourselves a great weekend, and while you're out driving, don't forget, state law in Ohio requires you to have your headlights on when your wipers are on.